Shire this week. I'm down at the HRPA conference in Toronto, and I'm speaking with Bill Greenhouse, CEO of the Human Resources Professional Association. Welcome. Thank you, Sarah. Thank you. So how is the conference going so far? It's been great. Um, okay. Early days yet, but uh, the trade show has been phenomenal, the sponsorship has been great, yep. and of course the layout of the trade show, as you've seen walking right, around, right. is much more open and yep. uh, it's, it's fantastic, I yep. love it. I very really nice, love it. very nice, okay. And so of course the HRPA has had a very busy year with the yep. launch of your new certification. Can you talk a bit about how that's gone? It has been absolutely incredible. Uh, you know, as you say, it's been a, a very busy year. There have been a number of different things that we've been working on for some time mm -hmm. that just happened to occur in the year. Right. At the beginning of the year, a new act was passed, which updated the act from the 1990s. Yep. So it really brought our regulatory processes into the 21st century. Going back 18 months, we started looking at our designations and the body of knowledge, and it was pretty apparent that the body of knowledge that the designation was based on goes back to the 1990s, and so much has changed in the world of work. It, sure. it just, it's, a, it's a completely different world. The expectations on HR professionals has grown, changed dramatically. Uh, the, the need for analytics, a strategy, uh, and many of the what we call enabling competencies, the team building type of uh, uh, approach, all of those things have to be built in. So looking ahead, what uh, is a continuation of that process? or what Yeah, uh, this year is going to be another uh, eventful year mm -hmm. for the association. We will continue with the Act rollout. Yep. I mentioned the, the government appointees. Yep. The uh, designation marketing right. will really start in earnest in the next couple of weeks. Sure. So all that whole process of, of promoting these new designations, particularly to organizations, to explain to them the value that that these designations, these people who are validating those designations that they bring. Yeah. It makes it a lot simpler as well for organizations because they know now, you know, someone on the CHRP, a CHRL, or the CHRE, the, yeah. the entry professional on the executive level, they'll know exactly what the, the validator is being able to do. But besides that, there's a whole range of different things. We've got a series of, we've got a series of dinner events, which okay. are quarterly, yeah. uh, which are really small, intimate um, sessions for very senior, the, the most senior HR person in the organization, eight to 10 at a time to meet with, with, with executives to talk about HR and to network. Right. We're launching a, a lunch series, again, that'll be monthly, and it's, it's called the Author Series. So we've got an author coming in to talk about work that he's done, a book that he's written. Uh, you may know Bill Conaty, for example, who is the yeah. VP of, of HR with Jack Welsh at GE. Right. He's one of the people, that's the kind of caliber of the, okay. uh, of the luncheon series. Yeah. And that'll be a kind of a, a subscription series um, throughout the year. Uh, the other great thing is um, it's, 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 called, it's a TV show we're launching, mm -hmm. like HR TV, I think you, you probably HR know about that. HR This Week, yes. HR This Week, indeed, yeah. And that'll be launched in conjunction with HR Reporter. Right. And I think that's going to be phenomenal. Yeah. Once a week, 30 minutes, the HR newsmakers, uh, what's happening in the world in HR, you know, challenges, events, everything to do with HR, yeah. will be a, that broadcast will go out for 30 minutes every week. So right. we're really, uh, really looking forward to that. I think it's going to be yeah. fantastic. That's going to be exciting. Really exciting. Okay. Um, and uh, there's a whole range of other things. Uh, we've got, for example, um, uh, we're introducing in, in conjunction with our designations and the professional development that has to go with them, we're introducing a self-assessment process where people can go in and say, okay, so where am I in my career? Where do I fit? Where does, what do I need to do to get the designation? Okay. What programs and courses do I take? Yeah. So we're working with a company now to develop that as we run through the year. So right. it's a, a busy year ahead indeed. Excellent. Okay. Well, I think that's all I had. Thank you very okay. much. Enjoy the rest of the show. Thank you very much, sir. Okay. Pleasure talking to you.